If you know, you know. And Dana White say it ain't so. Man, you done hurt Conor McGregor feelings with this. So Dana White came out and stated that Conor McGregor will be back next year. Khabib is the man now. Conor isn't the man anymore. So Khabib get to sit back and call the shots. So y'all recall the time when Khabib told Conor McGregor, after I beat you, I'm not even going to give you the rematch. I'm going to make you beg for it. And that's exactly what Khabib is doing. And that's exactly what Conor McGregor end up doing is begging for another ass whooping. Can you believe that? How quick does the world turn around? Now, Conor McGregor obviously wasn't cool with that. And he responded to Dana White by saying, who's not the man? Question mark. Your man had the Morocco event, did he? More like an event in the Morocco. A tent in the fucking sand it was. Keep spoofing yourself, self horse, jack strap sniffer champions. Man, listen. Conor McGregor be talking out of his ass. Then, not too long after, Khabib checked Conor McGregor by stating, This is a fiasco, why no? And I told y'all a while ago that Khabib told y'all that he was going to make Conor McGregor beg. And that's exactly what Conor McGregor is doing. Now, Khabib also had more to say. He stated, in Moscow, rapists are not expected. Now, Khabib is taking shots at Conor McGregor because, as I reported earlier, he has another rape allegation. So, Conor McGregor, he has to put some respect on his name. He got to go clear his name. He got to show up to court and explain himself because there's a lot of allegations against him. And obviously, the worstest one is hitting the old man for no reason. And that's caught on camera. So he is a wild man. After Khabib took his soul, he has nothing to lose now. He's asking to get locked up. However, apparently, if you're from the hopeless, you could do whatever and still get away with it. Now, he's supposed to be holding a press conference, so we'll see what he has to say. I will keep y'all upgraded. For the meantime, Khabib checked his ass, and his boss, Dana White, told him, you no longer the man. Khabib done filled in for the empty space that Conor McGregor left after he snatched Conor McGregor's soul. That being said, Conor McGregor been searching for his soul ever since, and he's lost in the sauce, to say the least. That being said, Conor McGregor has way more bigger issues than the problems that he has in the octagon. Because, yeah, he begging for another ass whooping, but he has bigger charges to face outside of the octagon. From rape charges, from two different women, from hitting old man, from smashing his own fan's cell phones. So he got to deal with all of that before hopping back in the octagon. Funny enough, he ain't been to court since the bus incident. And they try to paint the image that Khabib was, was the bad guy. When it's Conor McGregor. When Khabib is as good as it gets. As far as a role model. As, as far as a person that is a good and a great example. Forget being a great example. He's an elite example. Because he's a fighter that is very religious. Very respectful. Uh, respect his family. His dad. And at the end of the day, a person like that gets all the love and support. And that's why his name is Habib, because he the beloved of the UFC fans and any sport fans in general. That being said, Conor McGregor got what he deserved. Now, hopefully he get what he deserved in the courtroom as well. Now, that being said, no man is guilty till proven so. You know, every man is innocent till proven guilty. That being said, we'll see what happens in the courtroom and we'll see what Conor McGregor has to say. Check out my new show, Split Decision. It's a boxing debate show where it's called Split Decision. However, I'm looking for the knockout every show and I believe I knocked out Professor Nim. Now, he feels otherwise, so y'all be the judge. Check out my new show. I just dropped Split Decision episode five and tell me who y'all who y'all think won the debate. Hashtag Aki, hashtag Professor Nim. So subscribe below and click on the notification bell to get notified every time we go live. 
and subscribe below if you're trying to get smarter by the minute if you're trying to get dumber by the second don't and listen to the old media and check out Luna Tune for the funniest boxing memes all these links will be in the description box below and to be continued on the next episode of Aki TV peace and we out of here